813 happening now. Local florists are in their final frantic hours of work for Valentine's Day deliveries. Oh, and one popular spot is McNamara Florist. News 8's Lakin McGee is at, the lo at that location. And Lakin, what's happening there right now? Happy Valentine's Day. Oh, my goodness. I have been surrounded by flowers since 5.30 this morning. And I can tell you that the smell, I, I thought it was a beautiful smell. Now I'm kind of numb to it. That's what we've been saying. We're kind of numb to it. Uh, but we got staff back here. They're working. Uh, they're hard at work just to get those deliveries out. Joining me is Aaron Davidson here. Uh, so you were the one telling me, oh, yeah, you'll go numb to it. <laughs> yeah. I officially I'm, have. I'm used to it by now. So uh, unfortunately, I don't smell it as much. But every time someone walks in, they said, oh, my gosh, it smells so good in here. <laughs> so and, and you're like, oh, no, I don't. Okay. <laughs> I didn't think that would happen to me. But, yeah, now, now I can't even yeah. tell. But you guys have been busy. You said mm -hmm. this is your Super Bowl. Mm -hmm. So how many locations do you have? We have eight locations around the city, including a greenhouse up in Fort Wayne where we grow all of our blooming plants, all of our tulips and hyacinths that are um, we're sending out for deliveries. We grow those ourselves. Um, so Carmel, Fishers, Fort Wayne, Geist, Broad Ripple, um, Greenwood. We have a Willow Lake store on 86th Street. And then, of course, this location um, at North Mass. So. And you guys have been busy. I mean, I think I've seen... Oh, gosh, I lost count of how many trucks have actually been coming yeah. in and out. But I, I posted on Facebook, you guys actually loading them up into trucks. Uh, you're going to be doing this pretty much all day at all, all the locations. Long. Yeah, all day long. We do guarantee delivery um, to businesses by 5. And then hopefully we'll have all of our other deliveries done by 6 p.m. tonight. So um, that's why we start early so we can get them done on time. And I know you said that roses, are the, they're the most popular flower of this time of uh, year for Valentine's Day. Are we sold out or are we getting more? We are getting more red roses in um, sometime today. And then we also have beautiful other roses in stock of colors. Um, and we do have more trucks of flowers coming in. And, of course, um, we have arrangements that have roses in them with, uh, you know, other mixed flowers, which really give the arrangements a longer vase life um, when you get a mixed arrangement. So, And we know there's going to be a lot of last-minute shoppers out there. Yep. Try not to do that, guys. <laughs> but tell us, when is the last time that they can actually order something or yeah. come in and buy yeah. purchase a flower? Um, so our deliveries um, for today will be cut off pretty soon um, just because we don't have as much capacity. But all of our stores are open until 7 p.m., so you can walk in even at 6.59. We'll take care of you. Um, so just come in and get your flowers. Perfect. Erin, thank you so much. We appreciate it. I am super excited for Valentine's Day. Uh, I've been around these flowers all morning, so... You know what? I better get some flowers. My husband better be on it. And he, I, if he's watching this, Jose, I'm letting you know you need to be purchasing me some flowers. All right, guys, make sure you are uh, not doing those last minute shopping. Uh, but for now, I'm Lake and McGee for Wish TV, wishtv.com. Follow us on Facebook. That was subtle, wasn't it? <laughs> Very subtle. <laughs> I hope Lakin gets her flowers as well.